Hello friends. Today we are doing a question on um, quadratic equation. This is important for class 10th and 11th class students. This question is based on exponents part. Here we go. 5 raised to power 1 into 5 raised to power x. 5 raised to power 1 into 5 raised to power minus x is equal to 26. A raised to power m, A raised to power n is A raised to power m plus n. We'll just do this process generally in exponents. Here we do the reverse. Here. A raised to power m into A raised to power minus n is A raised to power m minus n. We just did this process here. Now, 5 raised to power 1 is 5 into 5 raised to power x plus 5 upon 5 raised to power x is equal to 26. What is that? A raised to power minus m is 1 upon a raised to power m. Your power should be in positive. Now put 5 raised to power x as any variable like y. So it is 5y plus 5 upon y is equal to 26. We just take out the LCM. 5y square upon 5 upon y is equal to 26. This y goes here becomes 5y square plus 5, 26y, take 26 there, it's standard form, 5y square minus 26y plus 5 is equal to 0. Now you can solve this equation by quadratic formula or middle term, anything. Like factorization middle formula, quadratic D formula, or your favorite is completing the square method. So anything, I, I prefer f this, minus 25y, minus y, plus 5 equals 0. Now, 5y minus 1 equals 0, the product of two things is 0, either of them is 0. y is equal to 1 by 5, y is equal to 5. But you need to find the answer of x. 5 raised to power x is equal to y, and y is 1 upon 5, and 5 raised to power x is equal to y, y is 5, so here 5 raised to power x is equal to 5 raised to power minus 1, and here 5 raised to power x is equal to 5 raised to power 1, here the x of answer is minus 1, and the answer of x is 1. So you can check, if you put minus 1, 5 raised to power 0 is 1. If we put minus 1, this is 2. 5 raised to power 2 is 25. 25 plus 1 is 26. And here, if you put this answer as well, you can check. It is verified. The both answers are correct. I hope you understood this kind of question because this is a quadratic equation question uh, which is based on the exponents property that you did in class 9th and 8th. God bless you all.